setting up our next big adventure. Uh, I went on the Matterhorn a lot of times. Look who we found in Oregon. We found one of our favorite YouTubers. But Kate, you booked a first class ticket. Why are you in coach? Today has been very stressful. Our cabin attendant looks just like Amelia Clark. And it's well worth the 200 bucks. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? We are in California house sitting and pet sitting for this adorable dog. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, she wants to be on camera. And these beautiful bunnies. Well, it's official. We're not gonna be able to go to Japan. Uh, they haven't reopened yet for tourism. No, God, please, no, no! So what we have been doing is scrambling around, setting up our next big adventure. And I gotta say, we're pretty excited for it. I am, it's someplace I've never been before. Well, we need to get back to planning this. The people we're house sitting for, who are our dear friends, are on their way back from Disneyland as we speak. And we gotta get this done before we leave. Could not pass up the opportunity to sit out here and catch the girls getting back from their trip to Disneyland. Should be here any minute. I told him I was making faces behind him in the window, but I don't know if he can see it. <laughs> He's too reflective. <laughs> <laughs> well, now they have a whole welcoming committee out here. Uh-oh, they're back. We look like we're creeping on him from behind the bushes. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this one. Thing one and thing two. Tell us about your trip. Uh, it was good. Uh, I went on the Matterhorn a lot of times and uh, it was packed. Uh, Were you Springs scared? Springs. No, the Matterhorn is uh, fun. Uh, the Yeti is loud, but uh, it was busy. It's hard without a pass. Well said. Without, what the heck, the fast passes. <laughs> Nightmare Before Christmas ears. Oh yeah, uh -huh. those are homemade. Classic. Uh, Are they? Star and Star Wars, Wars ears? Yeah! <laughs> oh, by the way, this is Gia, and this is Sophia Anna Maria. <laughs> Who's that guy? Nobody important. Now, <laughs> blow your face out. He's the <laughs> one who really wanted to go to Disney. <laughs> the truth! Now all the they want to do is get inside right. and... <laughs> Relax. At least that's what I do after trip. I just want to veg out. I think there's unpacking to do. Lates. <laughs> Is that on? All right. No Look who we found in Oregon. We found one of our favorite YouTubers. Okay, we didn't find her. We met her here. One of our favorite YouTubers that we met. Another girl from Oregon that was taken off around in Asia. That's kind of how we got to talking. Yeah. This is Brooke from Brooke on Foot. Hi, everyone. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's a theme. None of our vlogger friends can talk on camera, I mean, <laughs> including yeah. us. We're here from Portland. It's really cold here. Really cold. I am missing the beaches and the sunsets. So do you want to say where you're headed to next? You're going to keep that a secret. I'm going to keep it a secret, but I am going somewhere completely new that I have never been before and is technically on a different continent. So we'll see. That is awesome. <laughs> so seriously, why we started watching Brooke's videos we, when she had like a hundred subscribers. Now she's like YouTube royalty. She's all oh, up in there with it in the big time. <laughs> but she does fantastic travel videos with great music selection and we understand just Thank how you. hard that is. Thank you, yeah. I appreciate that. We just sat here and visited for like seven hours when we met up for coffee and so now we all have to run off to dinner, but it's yeah. awesome to meet you guys. It was so wonderful to meet you guys. This was fun. It was so good. All right. Shut okay. up, we're all vaccinated. <laughs> yes. But Kate, you booked a first class ticket. Why are you in coach? Because uh, apparently they couldn't get our bags all the way. So we had to. I think what you're trying to say is more to follow. Yes, there is so much more to follow. Let's hope the next leg is okay. Adventure. <laughs> Very stressful. It's 
really nice to relax. We got to one airport and they said they couldn't check our bags all the way through, so they threw us on another flight so we could get to Seattle in time. And so they got us here an hour earlier than we were supposed to, and then we had problems. I'm thank goodness we're going to Switzerland because if we didn't have a code and a scan code for COVID, we would have had to go through all this even more rigor the world. So I'm just really glad to be here. <laughs> Thank you so much. This is very comfortable. We got some water. They asked if we wanted a glass of water. We have a vanity mirror, so you know I can look at myself. These are really comfortable seats. They go all the way flat. We have a pillow, our blanket, and everything else is in here. Really comfy. I might watch this movie because we do have nine hours. <laughs> oh my God, are these seats comfortable? Oh, and breakfast. So evening to you with the light deck, just in case we uh, uh, run over any potholes on the way or something this evening. We would recommend you just keep the seat on this task. Uh, and I'll be on the ETA and the weather. So in the meantime, our cabin attendant looks just like Amelia Clark. Amelia <laughs> Clark? What do you think? What do you think? Oh, come no, on. Oh, totally. <laughs> That's right. I don't think anything like her. Dracaris. We got. Let's see. Socks. That one's cool. Ooh, it smells good. Chapstick. Toothbrush. Earplugs. Just in case you snore, but she doesn't. Toothbrush. And something so small I can't read. Spa. <laughs> What's a spa? Yeah, well, what is it? <laughs> Lip balm. And a pin. Make me look beautiful. You're already there. Now we gotta get ready for takeoff. This has been one of the most enjoyable flights I've ever been on. This is definitely the way to go. Food, the attendance, everything was top notch. Definitely, uh, I do the scan. I was hoping that our flight was a little longer than nine hours. That says a lot. <laughs> I just texted that same thing to my mom. I was like, I, can, I didn't want to land. Everything, the seats are super comfortable. <laughs> The tripod sinking as I'm talking. The seats are comfortable. The food's amazing. The flight crew is fantastic. This is the most comfortable flight I've ever been. Now we're spoiled. British Airways, business class. It's gotta happen. Oh, by the way, guess who just reached their fifth continent? Bye. That's pretty cool. Yay, we're here. First time in Europe. Right now. We're in the BA, BA, BA lounge. British Airways. British Airways lounge, getting uh, something to eat before we head to a hotel to spend the night before we get to the next leg of our journey. It has been quite an adventure. Details to follow, or not. I mean, there's not a lot of details, I guess. So we weren't supposed to have to leave the secure area of the airport. 
but we got improper information, so we did have to leave. And but hey, it was it's an adventure, and so now we're gonna go to a hotel for the night. I guess it wasn't really all that complicated. For the night, it's small, it's comfy, and it's well worth the 200 bucks. We are staying at the Air Hotel in Terminal 3 of London Heathrow Airport. We have to fly out tomorrow morning very early. Uh, we need to be there by 6, so this makes it nice. We can just walk downstairs and grab the train right over to our terminal and go right into security. I'm trying to stay awake because it's 1 p.m. here and I really want to take a nap, but we're going to try and stay up until 8, so I have 8 hours. Oh, it's going to be hard. <laughs> So I've concocted this plan for us to hop on the Heathrow Express train to go down to downtown London. We weren't even planning on, we weren't supposed to leave security at the airport, but we had to. So, man, let's go down and see some stuff. And it'll keep us away. We'll know tomorrow. We might just pass out here, but I'll tell you, we stopped at that British Airways lounge, the arrivals lounge at Heathrow. They were getting ready to close, but they still let us in and give us some, some soup and some coffee. It was amazing. That place was spectacular. Yeah, I wish we had more time because um, I really like to spend a lot of time there. They have like hydrotherapy showers and the place was gorgeous. I could spend the day there and if we come back through, we'll make sure that we set our timing so that we can. But now it's time for a shower, so we'll catch you later. Keep drinking this coffee. <laughs> Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>